down here in southern Costa Rica, around this corner, is one of the world's largest corpse plants, which means it's got one of the biggest flowers, and it also smells like a corpse. So the name of this corpse flower is Dracontium pitieri. And there it is. In all its glory. The back side is kind of green and purple. And you can see that it's quite a tall plant. It's probably close to 10 feet full height. Uh, and the flower itself is probably 18 to 20 inches tall from the top of that. Um, stalk of some type uh, and the surrounding plants that one right there if you can see it is a smaller one again these are the young plants it's basically got three leaflets and then here's the complex of the other ones you see the the mother plant of the flower is this one off to the left right here as it goes up it's kind of in decline and then we've got the main flower stalk and then we've even got a taller one up here it's also known as the snake plant snake skin plant because as you can see it's got skin or it's got uh, bark or whatever it's called on the outside of a plant that looks a little bit like snake skin depends on who you ask i've seen it bloom only twice in 11 years each time the flower opening was away from the trail this makes it really difficult to see into the flower and it took me a couple of tries before i got it somewhat right All right, so I'm standing down here in a kind of a bad situation. It's tough to stand because it's on a steep angle. But there is our corpse plant. It smells like rotting fish. Dracontium pit pitteri. I don't know if you can hear the flies around it, but the flies are certainly flying in around it because it does smell like a corpse. And here's another angle of our corpse plant. You can see that um, full extension of the selfie stick here is 48 inches and my arms too. So gives you an idea of how big the plant is. Just an outstanding plant. Fortunate that we have so many of them here in our forest here in Southern Costa Rica.